Hello everyone, so today we will be entering chapter 1 which is on physical quantities and measurement. So there will be two subtopics in this chapter. The first one would be on dimensions of physical quantities. So in this subtopic, you need to be able to define dimension, determine the dimensions of derived quantities, as well as verifying the homogeneity of equations using what we know as dimensional analysis. Right, so there are two types of quantity. The first one is basic quantity while the other is derived quantity. Basic quantity is a quantity that cannot be derived. Whereas derived quantity is a quantity that is obtained by deriving it from any base quantities. Okay, so let's go into dimension. So what is dimension actually? Well, dimension is something that denotes the physical nature of a quantity. So some of the symbols we use are capital L for length, capital M for mass, and capital T for time. The bracket that we are using here is, is this bracket. So why are we using that? It is because we have to denote that it is the dimensions of a physical quantity. Lah. Okay, so for length, uh, so what I've mentioned is this, it's this one here. And then these are some of the rules of dimensions in which we will be applying when we are trying to find the dimensions of derived quantity. Okay, so you'll understand more on these rules when you start doing more exercises and the tutorial questions. Lah. Okay, so this one, this table shows uh, some of the types of physical quantities along with their SI unit and the symbol of the unit. Lah. And for this one, these are some of the examples for derived quantity. Okay, so the formula here is given because you need to be able to know how to calculate each of this quantity why because we are we will be using this to find a uh, four dimensional analysis uh, to, so that we can find the si unit here okay so prefixes pula it is used to present larger and smaller values so in physics they expect you to be able to know each prefixes along with its multi multiplication uh. okay so that is uh, basically it for the theory on chapter 1, subtopic 1.1.